Good evening, everyone. Welcome to Jazz at Lincoln Center's a swinging Sesame Street celebration. The orchestra and I are honored to be celebrating 50 years of Sesame Street right here tonight in the House of Swing. Sesame Street has helped all of us grow smarter, stronger, and kinder. All over the world, it has exposed children and adults alike to a wondrous range of music with so many catchy and classic songs, many of which you're going to hear tonight with new arrangements done by members of our orchestra. Now, I invite all of you, young and old, to participate, sing along, dance. Join us as we take a trip to and down Sesame Street, which is a wonderful place to be. Sweeping the clouds away On my way to where the air is sweet Can you tell me how to get How to get to Sesame Street? Sesame Thank you, Abby, yeah, yeah. Elmo, and of course, Big Bird looking magnificent. You do, that's a nice tie. I always love that tie, Big Thank Bird. Thank you. Doesn't he look good, folks? We're happy to have you all tonight. Oh, well, we're really happy too, Mr. Whitney. Yeah. All of our Sesame Street friends are excited to sing some jobs. Yeah, we sure are. Yeah. Oh, oh, Elmo has to go warm up. See you later, oh, okay. Big Bird. Oh, okay. That's Elmo. <laughs> You know, tonight, it's going to be a lot of fun. And now I'd like to introduce Winton's co-hosts for the evening. Here they are, Bert and Ernie. Hi. Uh, <laughs> hi, Winton. Say, uh, Winton, have you seen Ernie? No, no. We're supposed to be hosting together, and I can't find him anywhere. <laughs> Ernie. <laughs> Ernie, what That's are right. you doing? Oh, hi there, buddy Bert. I just got out of the tubby. I was getting all squeaky clean, you know, before the old big jazz show thing. Now, uh, which, which way to my dressing room so I can put my tux on in time for the show? Ernie, hmm? the show has already started. Go! <laughs> um, hi, everybody. Uh, uh, say hi, Rubber Ducky. Yeah, you're right. 
Looks like we're a little underdressed. Yeah, I'll say. Mm. Oh, I knew we needed a rehearsal. This is so embarrassing. Yeah. I'm so sorry, Mr. Marcel. I'm so uh, don't sorry. Don't you worry about it. Don't worry about it at all. We love it. It actually reminds me of one of my very favorite songs. Oh, well, that's flattering, Winton, but this is hardly the time for me to sing Doing the Pigeon. Oh, no, 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 <laughs> not about you. I'm talking about Ernie's song. What? The one about Ooh. his rubber ducky. What? Oh, rubber ducky. Oh, that's my favorite song. Hey, if you know it, feel free to sing along. <sighs> I'll go look for your tux. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Make bath time lots of fun. Rubber ducky, I'm awfully fond of you. Vo, 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 dio. Rubber ducky, boy of joys. When I squeeze you, you make noise. Rubber ducky, you're my very best friend, it's true. Oh, every day when I make my way to the tubby, I find a little fella who's cute and yellow and chubby. Rub a dub dubby, rubber ducky, you're so fine. And I'm lucky that you're mine. Rubber ducky, I'm awfully fond of you. Way to the tubby, I find a little fella who's cute and yellow and chubby. Rubber -a dub dubby, rubber ducky, you're so fine, and I'm lucky that you're mine. Rubber ducky, I'd like a whole pond of rubber ducky. I'm awfully fond of you. Uh, thanks, thanks for singing along, and, and a big rubber ducky thank you to Chris for all those extra sweets back there. <laughs> Ooh, goodness, uh, I better go see if Bert found my tux yet. Hey, Bert, Bert! Uh, I don't know, I think he went this way. Bert! Yeah, let's hear it for Ernie. Good job, Ernie! Vo, 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 What's up, y'all? Hi, Hoots. Are you ready to sing with Elmo, Hoots? Yeah, man, you ready, Elmo? Yeah, Elmo can't wait. All but right. Then, wait a minute, what should we sing about? Oh, we can sing about anything you want, man. Yeah, Elmo, that's the best part about music. It can be about the things you love, places you've been, and people you know. And songs can even cheer you up when you're feeling sad. Right, everybody? Yeah, that's right, yeah. Or you could sing a song about your friends. Ah. Or about your favorite kazoo. <laughs> <laughs> See, Elmo, you can sing about all those things. Really? Yeah, you bet. Hey, hey, let's show them, gang. Sing a song about sunshine. Sing a song about taking a walk in the rain. Sing a song about daytime. Why not sing about taking a ride on a train? You can't go wrong when you're singing a song. Really? Yeah, sing it loud, sing it strong. It feels good when you sing a song. Now let me sing a song about new friends. Sing a song about tomorrow and yesterday. Sing a song about old friends. Old friends. Why not sing about going outside to play? It can't be bad. Sing it. Even if it's sad, <laughs> sing it loud, sing it strong. It feels good when you sing outside. Sing a song about birds and plants and bees and ants and anything that comes along. Sing a song about loving or crying, a banana or a lion. Sing a song about the short or the tall. 
big and small. Or anything at all. Sing a song about moonbeams. Yeah. Sing a song about coconuts in your head. Sing a song about daydreams. Daydreams. Sing a song about orange, yellow, blue, white hair. You'll never lose. Sing it high, sing it low. Sing it fast, sing it slow. If you can bring it, sing a song. Elmo? Yeah. <laughs> okay, Hoots, thanks for singing, but Elmo. Yeah, Elmo's welcome. gonna figure out what number he'd like to do next. Bye. You know what you gonna do next? Hey, Elmo. Hey, hey Elmo, wait for me, man. Come on, we, we gotta go. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, well, maybe we'll, we'll ask. Look, I'll ask. Okay, oh, Mr. Wenton. Mr. Wenton. Yeah. Yeah. Mr. Wenton yeah. over here. It's yep. me, uh, Big Bird. Uh, 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 Abby. Oh. That's right, like jazz musician. Mm -hmm. You know, um, skitty boop bop ba doop. Yeah. Oh, you're yeah. talking about you want to scat. That's when you sing syllables and sounds to make melodies instead of using words. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, you're talking about great musicians like Louis Armstrong and Dizzy Gillespie. Go something like this. What? That, yes, that's yes. what we want to, that thing right there. That's what we want to do. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Like, just like Dizzy. Yes. And, and you know what? We, we want everybody to help us out, too. Yeah, yeah. So if I sing, baby doo bop doo bop. Then we're all going to sing, baby doo bop doo bop. Hey, that yeah. wasn't bad. That was pretty good. I think they can do it, Abby. What do you think? Well, I think so. I think you sound great. So warm it up. What do you think, Vince? You know, I think we can help with that. Ooh. This is Sing After Me, the special scat edition. Ooh. All right, we got this, Big Bird. Yeah, we do. It's a dream come true. It is. Why don't you start? Okay. I sing what I sing. Sing after me. I be my echo. If you can be. Sing zooba dooba da. Zooba dooba da. Doobie doobie dee. Dulia, dulia, da, da. Zik, zik, zik. Zik, zik. Yeah. Bop, do, bop, do, Zip, it, zip, it, zip. Be my echo. Scat what I scat. Follow the leader and sing. I Bird. think so too, but maybe this we should try so again. Cool. Here we go. I sing what I sing. Sing after me. I'll be my echo if you can be. Sing zaba dippy doo. I do ba diddly dee. Do 
Zippity 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 Mr. Winton, uh -huh. Mr. Winton, uh -huh. Mr. Winton, uh -huh. how, 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 how'd we do? Huh? Well, let me see. Let me ask the orchestra. How did uh, how did they do? Oop, bops, and bam. Oop, bop. Uh, 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 is that good or bad? That means you did great. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> Thank you guys too for helping. Thanks. Thanks. Come on, Abby. We spoke jazz. Before. We did. We spoke jazz. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Cute song, fellas. Yeah, really cute. Oh, and great singing, everyone. Yuck! What are you trying to do to me? It's hard enough being a grouch on Sesame Street. Now I have to be at a jazz concert where every sound's in tune. Oh. And all those enjoyable melodies. Oh. But I tell you what, they've got no place in grouch music. Yeah, that's right. Hey, that makes me think of one of my favorite grouch tunes. By famous grouch musicians Joe Raposo and John Stone, and arranged by the rottenest grouch I know, Sherman Irby. This is one of these things. Hey, now this is how an orchestra should dress. You guys look awful. <laughs> now follow along. One of these sounds is not like the others. One of these sounds does it belong? Can you tell which sound is not like the others by the time I finish my song? Did you guess which sound was not like the others? Did you guess which sound does it belong? If you guess this sound is not like the others, then you're absolutely right. Yeah, yeah, you see, those two are trumpets over there. Yeah, and this, this is called a grumpet. Yeah, music to my grouchies. One of these things is not like the others. One of these things just doesn't belong. Can you tell which thing is not like the others by the time we finish our song? Guess which thing was not like the others? Did you guess which thing just doesn't belong? If you guess this one is not like the others, then you're right. <laughs> yeah, this is called a trom groan. Yeah, and those those are just plain old saxophones. <laughs> <laughs> See how completely different grouch instruments look and sound? 
Just add it to the list of things that makes us grouches so different. Well, sure, grouches may like different musicals, Carito, but there are ways. We are the same, too. Yeah, Oscar. Yep. No, no, wait, you two think you have something in common with grouches? Ah, fooey. What's up, Elmo? Hi. Oh, Elmo knows what song he would like to do next. What is that? Are you ready? You're going to be shocked at the selection Elmo chose. Get ready for the shock of your life. It's called Elmo's Song. <laughs> what a great title. <laughs> Every song you sing should be called that. Oh. Well, well, will Mr. Winston and the band play with Elmo, please? Of course. OK, thank you. That is a great song. Oh, thank you. You know what? You know what? Elmo just thought of a brand new verse. I don't believe it. Believe it, baby, it's true. Oh. Ready? What is it? A one, a two, uh. one, two, three. This is the song, la, 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 Winton song. La, 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 Winton song. That's a great song. I don't Thank deserve you. the honor. Oh, well, Elmo's so happy to be here with you. Thank you for playing it with Elmo, everybody. See you later. Well, I'd like to visit the moon On a rocket ship high in the air Yes, I'd like to visit the moon but I don't think I'd like to live there Though I'd like to look down at the earth from above I would miss all the places and people I love So although I might like it for one afternoon I don't want to live on the moon
I could meet all the fish everywhere. Yes, I travel under the sea, but I don't think I'd like to live there. I might stay for a day there if I had my wish, but there's not much to do when your friends are all fish. And oyster and clam aren't a real family, so I don't want to live on the sea. I'd like to visit the jungle, hear the lions roar. Go back in time and meet a dinosaur. There are so many strange places I'd like to be, but none of them permanently. I was home once again Though I'd like to look down at the earth from above I would miss all the places and people I love So although I may go, I'll be coming home soon Cause I don't want to live on the moon No, I don't want to live on the moon I'm talking about. Right, that's what's up. Are y'all ready to hear some more beautiful sounding jazz music? Yeah. <laughs> wait, wait a minute. Hold, hold on, hold on here. What in the world? Ernie, right. right, my man. Mm. What, 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 what are you doing? Oh, I'm playing the saxophone, Hoots. All righty, saxophone section, let's take it from the top. Hmm? All right. Okay, rubber ducky, that's our cue. <gasps> uh-huh. Hmm. I'm playing the saxophone just uh, not terribly well. Yeah, I'm having a little bit of trouble here. What's... Uh, uh, everybody, everybody, uh, uh, our friend Ernie here has got a little problem. Uh, you know, let's see if we can help him out. Excuse me, Mr. Hoots, I hate to bug a busy bird, but I want to learn the sax, and I need a helpful word. I always get a silly squeak when I play the blues. Ernie, keep it cool, I'll teach you how to blow the sax. I think I dig your problem, it's rubber and it cracks. You never find the skill you seek till you pay your dues. You gotta put down the ducky. Put down the ducky. Put down the ducky, cause you gotta leave the duck alone. Put down the ducky. Put down the ducky. Put down the ducky if you wanna play the saxophone. Here we go. I 
I've learned a thing or two from years of playing in the band. It's hard to play the saxophone with something in your hand. To be a fine musician, you're gonna have to face the facts. Throw your butt to fly your fingers when you wanna wear your stuck. The poor flying fingers if they're wrapped around the duck. Change the choice position if you wanna ace the sax. Yeah, put down the ducky. Put down the ducky. Put down the duck, you gotta leave the duck alone. Put down the ducky. Put down the ducky. Put down the ducky, you gotta leave the duck alone. Put down the ducky. Put down the ducky. Put down the ducky if you wanna play the saxophone. and I played the saxophone. Oh, thank you, Hoots. In it, time earning, my man. Oh, and thanks to my buddy Ted over there for helping me on the saxophone. Yeah, and thanks, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. And thanks to Sherman for helping this bird sound good. Mm. Hey, Ernie, yeah, you, you want to jam backstage, man? Oh, you know it, Hoots. Come well, on, let's, let's go, go, come on. Yeah. Flying mm -hmm. over this way, baby. Where do they put rubber ducks? <laughs> <in? laughs> <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, ladybugs came to the ladybug picnic. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, and they all played games at the ladybugs picnic. Then you were! Races. They fell on their backs and they fell on their faces. The ladybugs twelve at the ladybugs picnic. They played jump rope, but the rope broke. Don't give your sad round tail and knock knock jokes. The ladybugs twelve at the ladybugs picnic. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, and they got away at the ladybugs picnic. Well, they talked about the high price of furniture and the rugs and fire insurance for the ladybugs. The ladybugs twelve at the ladybugs picnic. Well, they talked about the high price of furniture and the rugs and fire insurance for the ladybugs. The ladybugs twelve. having such a good time. And to keep those good times rolling, please welcome back to the stage, Rosita. Hola, amigos. Oh, nice, gracias. It's just so wonderful to spend, you know, today here at the Rose Hall with, well, 
so many people from our neighborhood. Hola! <laughs> Do we have any teachers in the crowd? <gasps> Yay! We love teachers. And how about firefighters? Oh, thank you for your service. <laughs> any grouches in the crowd? Oh, yeah, that's a lot of grouches. <laughs> Rosita, huh? Rosita. Si? We can't forget about the musicians, Rosita. Oh, Carlitos. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, Carlitos, gracias por la música latina. De nada. Si? <laughs> and you're right, musicians are also people in the neighborhood. You know you're right, Rosita, and I wish I could dance with you, but you know what? Growing up here in the South Bronx, Music was all around me. There were musicians playing on the street corners, community centers, the subway, and all over the city. Musicians were some of the people that I'd meet each day. And did that make you want to be a musician doing all that stuff growing up? You know what, Rosita, it sure did. Yep. And we're going to play something for you. Let's meet more people in your neighborhood. All right, let's do this, Carlos. In your neighborhood, in your neighborhood, oh, who are the people in your neighborhood? The people that you meet each day. Hola, Rosita, hola. Hello. Look, 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 Elmo's pretending to be a person in the neighborhood. Oh, wow, can I guess? Who? Yeah, guess, guess, guess. Okay, well, let me see. Uh, you have ooh, a neighbor. An apron, yes, and yeah. a hat. You have a hat and you have a bag. Yes, a bag with cereal and lettuce and what is that? A, rad a radish? I think it's a radish. Oh, lots of groceries you have there, yeah. So groceries, you know. <sighs> oh, I know. Yes. I know who you are. Yes, you do. You're a nurse. No, no Rosita, no, no, no. Elmo is a grocer. Oh, a grocer. Oh, that makes a lot more sense. Yeah. Oh. oh, the grocer sells the things you need, like cereal and cheese and meat. Whatever food you're looking for, you're sure to find it in Elmo's store. Yeah, because a grocer is a person in your neighborhood. In your neighborhood. It's in your neighborhood. And a grocer is a person in your neighborhood. A person that you meet each day. Elmo has to make a delivery driver. What's going what? on here? Oh, oh. We all know who he is, right? Yeah, who is he? A doctor, you're right, Mr. Johnson right here is a doctor? Oh, uh, I'm not really a doctor, but I am a hypochondriac. Oh. oh, the doctor works the whole day long to help you keep feeling strong. But if my chance you're feeling sick, I'll try to make you feel well quick. Because the doctor is a person in your neighborhood. In your neighborhood. He's in your neighborhood. Yes, the doctor is a person in your neighborhood. A person that you meet each day. That's right. Okay. Oh, my tummy. Oh, should I call the doctor? Yeah. Yeah, let me take you to the doctor, Mr. people in our neighborhood. I know, I know, look at them. Yeah. yeah, but you know what's even more magical? What? Is when all the people come together and we make a community, like we're all here right now, right? Yeah, that's true. Yeah. And we have a community of musicians right here, jazz musicians. All right, Ted, count us in. A one, two, three, four. Oh, the jazz orchestra.
<laughs> and now, it is time for one of my favorite songs. Please join me, the cows, along with my chorus of cows. Come on in, ladies. Please welcome the Sirloin Sisters. This is the pinball number count. I shall count you in now. Here we go. A one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. You are with I don't know what that is. Wait. How do you stop this thing? Oh, okay, okay, here we go. Remember that doesn't ring a bell. Are you sure you're a superhero? Uh, yes. I have the cape. I have the muscles. Check those out, huh? Jealous, right? <laughs> Besides, I know I am a superhero because you can be anything you want to be, as long as you believe in yourself. At least that is what I learned from this next song. <laughs> this is believe. Yourself. Oh, you can be what you want to be, see what you want to see, believe in yourself. Believe in yourself. Yeah! Go where you want to go, do what you want to do, believe in yourself. Believe in yourself. Mm -hmm. Some folks try to tell you 
There are things you shouldn't do. You're not strong enough or smart enough, that's all. But what seems right to them often might be wrong for you. That's true. So be sure you try to climb before you get too scared you fall. Oh, you can be what you want to be. Yeah. Learn what you want to learn. Believe, Believe in, in yourself. yourself. Believe in yourself. That's wrong. Try what you need to try. Uh -huh. No one can question why. Not Believe in yourself. Believe in yourself. Folks may say you're different, you that you've gone and lost your senses. <laughs> but the world is yours to walk in. Go ahead and leap the fences, and you'll see. Believe in yourself. And the world belongs to you and me. That's right, Grandma. Swing up. Thank you for the song, Super Grover. You really are a superhero. Oh, yeah. well, thank you. What is that? Yeah. My superhero ears hear a cat stuck in the balcony. Oh. Oh. This sounds like a job for... We have one more song for you here tonight, but before we get to that, I would like to say a great big sincere thank you to the Jazz at Lincoln Center Orchestra with the one and only Wynton Marsalis. Yeah, 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 yeah. And let's hear it for Dan on the piano. Yeah. And Jason on the drums. And my dear amigo Carlos on in the bass. And on saxophones, we've got Janelle, Paul, Ted, Sherman, and Victor. Yeah. On the trombones, we have Chris, Vince, and Elliot. And give it up for the greatest trumpet section around, Marcus, Ryan, and Kenny. Yeah. And ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Vinton Marcellus. That's wrong! That's wrong! Thank you so much. And thank you to Sesame Street for filling our hearts with joy and music for over 50 years. That's very well said, Mr. Winton. Well, thank you so much. You're welcome. I, I love having you up here. I'm gonna let you cheer. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> here is to 50 more years of Sesame Street. Please join me and thanking these wonderful performers. They are improvisers and they are hardworking and they are wonderful and we just absolutely love them. Chris, Carmen, Peter, Ryan, Eric, Leslie, and Matt. It's been such a pleasure. They are fantastic. And now we have one final song. And we want everyone to sing along. Yes, so everybody get up on your feet <laughs> and get ready to sing out loud with an arrangement by Ted Nash 